friends my name is bharat juneja and i welcome you to my youtube channel in this video we will see the details of all the blue prism certifications and how can we schedule the exam so here we go blue prism divided the certification in four categories first one is foundation second one is practitioner practitioner third one is professional and last one is specialist so for foundation we have associate developer certification for practitioner we have developer and for professional we have professional developer and solution designer and for specialist we have blue prism technical architect and rom architect and installation engineer you can find the details here let's see the details of each certification one by one here is our blue prism associate developer you can see the description and the exam details and preparation and this is the scope of the certificate
so these are all certifications now let's see the exam requirements so we can't reset in the exam if we already attended in the last 30 days and we got we were failed and for the blue prism professional developer you must have first passed the blue prism developer ad01 exam at least six months earlier and this is the price list of the certifications so in usd it's 150 dollar for all the certifications except associate developer associate developers cost is 140 to 140 usd now let's see how can we schedule the exam for this we have to go to this pearson view website and here we have to create a account you can read all the terms and conditions and fill all the details here your personal information Create your unique username. Click on finish and uh, now we will log in into our Pearson View account. After login, you will get this type of interface. Click on view exams. And here you can see the list of exams. Select the exam you want to schedule. Now select the language. Now select from where you got the training of Blue Prism. I'm selecting other and YouTube. And if you want to share your exam results with your employers, you can select I agree. Otherwise, you can select I disagree. Here are terms and conditions, admission policy, health and safety, safety related conditions. COVID guidelines, admission policy, you are required to present two forms of original valid government IDs. So whenever you go to the exam center, you have to, you have, you should have two government IDs, which contains your name, your recent picture and your signature. Now this one is the reschedule policy. If you want to reschedule your exam, you must inform Pearson View 48 hours prior to your exam appointment. Similarly, we have this cancellation policy as well. Now here we can find the test center. Select the area or your address in the search box and you can see the test center here. You can select three test centers means you can shortlist three centers and then you can select one of these three as per time and look availability so we have selected these three test centers you can select the date so for this we don't have any date in september now select the second one so we can see we can book from 13th or any date in September so I have selected 21 you can see the time here and if time is not suitable you can change the date or you can select another test center so here and there is also an option to explore more time you can select the time and book this appointment 
Now the time to pay one fifty dollars. Here we can pay one fifty dollars. Enter the card details and pay. And after clearing your exam, you will get a badge, and you can find this badge at Credly site. And these are the steps, or you will get an email also from Credly to claim your badge. And also after exam, we can see our score reports. Go to go here in your Pearson account and view score report. So you will get this type of score record report. Thanks guys for watching this video and good luck for your exam.